everyone, I am going to do a pick a card reading. Um, this time when I do it, um, it will be about what messages do you need to receive right now. So I'll give you a few minutes to pick the cards. Um, that's kind of brownish rock. It's like a circle rock. Then this is like a whitish sparkly rock rock and this is a clear quartz so this will be number one number two number three and number four do pick the one that resonates with you mu um, resonates with you the most and try to um, sometimes you can see something and it doesn't really resonate with you but um, sometimes just hearing the messages you'll find out which one resonates with so let's get started. <clears throat> the first three cards you have are the Seven of Swords, the Nine of Swords, and the King of Wands. So I feel like with this, the message that you need to hear is um, maybe something is in some way making you feel trapped, making you feel like you have to deal with unnecessary um Kind of like deception or um, feeling blocked in some way um, but I feel like here in order to move the or in order to have this um, more of an attitude of being more into your power I feel like you need to somehow release something or um, let go of something that does not res resonate with you in order to be more into your power so I feel like you need to release yourself with this message coming in. All right, next one is Nine of Wands, Three of Cups, and Eight of Swords. So I feel like with this, it's kind of like with that one, but it's more into... Um, I feel like in order to have this victory, um, maybe in a partnership, maybe in work, um, maybe in something you need to let go of something that's keeping you um, from receiving this blessing or receiving this um, blessing in disguise I feel like that if it is concerning a relationship I feel like there's some things that you need to let go that maybe in the past kept you binded in some ways enslaved <clears throat> and if it's concerning a job, I feel like that um, you just need to unblock yourself from um, whatever it's keeping you, um, like, in your thoughts and you can't seem to move forward. So I feel like it's best to calm your nerves, it's best to relax and to um, try to figure out what it is I, what it is you need to do in order to make this victory happen in your life. <clears throat> All right, next message is, is the, I think that was, yeah, that was back. Um, yeah, I got these cards messed up because I had to do this over again. This Ten of Wands, the King of Pentacles, and the Three of Swords. So I feel like with this, um, the message that you need to hear is, um, I'm getting, don't push something into expectation to get your heart broken. Um, this could be concerning maybe a new job, maybe a new relationship, but don't set yourself up for the failures of a heartbreak. That's what I'm getting with this. Because it's easy to get entrapped of pushing your way forward or having too much high expectation. But center yourself and focus on what is it that you want. <clears throat> and then the last one is the Justice card, the Tower, and the Death card. So whoever got this, I feel like the message for this is there is going to be sudden things that happen that you may be dealing with right now or you're going to deal with but in some way um you're gonna have to in some way overcome this obstacle 
either a rebirth of something or an ending of something. So don't get alarmed when I say that, but I feel like um, be be cautious of the choices that you're making, that you don't make the wrong choice, but the best choice for you so you don't have this issue going on. So I feel like that's the message. 